So is metaverse staking worth it? Well, if we're looking through a long-term scope of lens, we have two things going for us, passive income and appreciation, because we know the metaverse is still at its infancy. Now, the trick is figuring out where that appreciation is going to go, but in the short term, I think we have a pretty good idea. Now, if you're one of those people who like investing in the metaverse for a yield, but you don't really want to depend on a centralized exchange, you're going to like this video. So with that being said, there are a ton of projects out there that offer metaverse exposure, who offers very, very high APRs in the thousands and thousands of percent, which in my honest opinion, isn't sustainable, especially for the long term. Now, I chose to take a very small risk and in investing in the governance token of V Empire, which is currently the largest decentralized investment metaverse organization in the space today. And I also had the pleasure of having the CEO of V Empire on a live AMA on the channel last week. So definitely check that video out right here after this one. But I'm going to be showing you how much I'm staking. And as I mentioned, this was a small risk that I took. None of this is financial advice. And I'm also going to briefly share with you kind of my thought process as we look at the current price and a few other things. I'm also going to share with you a big, big speculation just based off of what I think could potentially happen based off of how this organization is set up. So let's check it out right after this. Welcome back to the channel millionaires. I'm Mike the investor. Now we are briefly looking at the community governance staking pool for V Empire staking the VIM token. Now, as you can see, I have a very small amount around 24,000 tokens. And if you look at the APR, 15% that they're currently paying and all of this money comes from you know all of their staking pools their games their grants and everything of that nature and so I definitely believe this is going to continue to stay sustainable or earlier this year this was around 10% when I was researching this project and now it is around 15% and so if we break down 15% real quick what that is in a month that's going to be about 1.25% so if we divide this by 12 for a 12 month calendar year, you can see that's gonna be 1.25% that you will earn on your investment, right? Now, of course, none of this is financial advice. I'm just being transparent with you, showing you uh, what I'm doing. Now, this is the world staking pool that you can earn you know, interest on, VIMP and the actual metaverse token. Now, one thing I do wanna mention briefly before we get off of here, this is a six to 12 month lockup if you are using these pools. So make sure you have a long-term you know, time frame if you're going to use it. Now, if you're using the VIMP pool right here, I can withdraw at any time. As you can see, I can withdraw at any time if I choose to, no problem. So if we happen to see a huge run up, I would definitely be able to take profits if that was my choice. Now, if we briefly just look at the home, this just tells you the total value locked across all the pools, circulating supply, market cap of VIMP 8.9 million, and then you have the VIMP price. Now we're briefly about to dive into that now. So here we have the VIMP token on Live Coin Watch. They say the market cap is around 9.7 million. Now, let me just show you real quick to be completely transparent with you. I have a little over 24,000 tokens, but we're just gonna be 24,000 just to be even. You can see it's a little over 1,200 bucks that is invested, right? So not a ton of money. However, investing in this project, as you can see on the 90 day, this baby has been beat all the way down, right? And so if we look right down here, you can see here's the all time high around 65 cents project launched, I believe back in September. And you can see a consolidated, a lot of consolidation here, which is where I got in, not back at this point, but I actually got in back around March 14th, around that uh, five cents mark is when I started staking the VIMP token. But you can see the market is like, VIMP, what are you doing up here? You have no support, right? And you're going to see it fall as well. But also to keep in mind, uh, I did hear there was a ton of FUD around this project. Also, not to mention, uh, this was the time when the crypto market was at its all time high and started to pull back. So this was the time when Bitcoin hit 69K, crypto market hit 3.1 trillion for the first time. And so as you can see, there's no support up here at all. And pulls back here to 50 cents as you can see really no support pulls back up and then pulls down to the first target that it hit on the way up for around 41 cents you can see here's 44 cents 
and you got 46 cents here, right? And so if you move here, 45, here's your 44, here's your 46 cents, here's the first big pull, which you're gonna see it hit a couple times as well. As we move down, here's the 31 cents on the way down. Here you have it, 29 to 31 cents, and then it hits 31 cents again. And then from there, it just keeps pulling back because there is no support. But now as we move here, we get down to where the support is. And this is where me personally, I got in, which lowers your risk tremendously because you've already seen it cool all the way off. And when you think about what this project is doing, the team is legit, the project is docs, they have uh, company reports as well. And that's something you definitely wanna see. Now, one thing I wanna briefly share with you, uh, if you look at right here, and this is all speculation, but because of how this project is set up, they are a owner of the Board Ape Yacht Club, 1124 NFT. So because of how this project is set up, potentially they could add a staking pool for their metaverse staking pool section because they did say in a live AMA, he's gonna be adding a Solana staking pool as well as a Neo staking pool. So imagine the value of VIMP if they could add ApeCoin with it being one of the hottest coins in the game right now. And remember, these are dual yield staking pools so they earn mana and VIMP. And if they wanna compound and earn double, they can come right over here, which is what I'm currently doing, staking the VIP token and earning a safe 15% APR in my personal opinion. Now, before we get out of here, just to look at a little numbers, just to have a little fun, you can see I'm currently around, you know, $1,200 invested with 24,000 tokens. The current price is around five cents. So let's say it retraces, right, to 65 cents. Let's go ahead and pull up the calculator. Now, of course, none of this is guaranteed, but we're just doing numbers to have fun since we're talking about it. I got my 24,000 tokens and we're gonna times that by 65 cents. And that's gonna give us about 15,000, 15,600 to be exact, right? And now in a perfect world with that 15%, you take times 15% APR, that's gonna give you around $2,300 in a year that you earn just for staking. And then of course, if you wanna break that down, we know 15 divided by 12 is 1.25%. So let's just say you have 15,000 times the one and a quarter. It's about $187.50, you know, a month that you're earning just for staking, not including the appreciation. Now, none of this is guaranteed. This is just, you know, looking at numbers, looking at what could potentially happen based off of, you know, your quantity amount. So, yeah, that is the risk I'm taking when it comes to Dow Metaverse staking. Once again, not saying you should do this. I'm just sharing with you what I'm personally doing. I'm just a guy on YouTube, you know, sharing with you different projects that you might find value in. If you gain some value from the video, smash the like button and I will see you on the next one.